what's up y'all this is how to customize your own YouTube channel basically I'm just gonna show you how to customize the YouTube uh, PSD that I made that you could download in the description right next to this video there's a rare file and then there's a zip file if you do not have a rare extractor like WinRare you cannot use the rare file it won't work so what you need to do is just go ahead and download the zip file basically this is it um, this is in a Photoshop right here. You have your text above where your display name would go. Like you can write welcome there. You have your text beside the column and then right a, a little above this, like right around here, is your, your subscribe button obviously. And then right here would be your top video. And then you would have your text three beside this. So what I normally do is I write welcome right here where it says text one, where it says text two I do subscribe and then I have an arrow brush or you can go to custom shapes and put an arrow in there and point it to your subscribe button and then you just write subscribe where text two is and you can just take your, um, what's it called, your text tool and click on it, delete what's there and put new and then you have your text three. <coughs> which you could probably write like top video or featured video and then you have your background which is white all you have to do is go to the background layer double click on it you can go to a color overlay do whatever you want and basically you pick your background color all that good stuff to do anything on just the background and not affect the middle just make a new layer between um, background and middle and go ahead and get a brush you could do all kinds of stuff and it's not going to affect the middle just the background and delete that um the middle once again just double click on it color overlay or gradient overlay whichever one that you want to use to pick the color whatever text you can change the text color and the font free will it's all up to you what you want i do suggest trying to keep it in the same area because if not then it won't match up to the actual youtube.com one so you want to keep it in this area and that's basically how you do it this image is I think 1490 by 5000 I'm not exactly sure I know it's 5000 long but I'm not exactly sure the width but it's pretty wide it'll f adjust to a screen um, unless you have like a ridiculously large screen but um that's pretty much it it's 5,000 long so if your YouTube is very long if you have like a lot of comments and your personal information is long and everything like mine is then it'll go all the way down without repeating and then you have your text there again and all kinds of crap so it will go all the way down and that's pretty much it hope you use this hope you learn rate comment subscribe to me definitely um, my name is Donnell Knight. You can contact me at myspace.com forward slash designs by Donnell or right here on this YouTube channel. Peace out.